How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to set up your photo stream on your PC so that any picture you take from um, your iPhone or iPad or iPod Touch that is uh, set up with iCloud, you'll be able to have those photos downloaded right to your computer. Okay? Um, and it does it automatically. So what you're going to do is go down to Start here and type in iCloud. Now here's the thing, you had to have already downloaded the uh, iCloud control panel onto your PC. So if you have not done that yet, um, I'm going to have a link in the video. Uh, click on the link and uh, download the, the PC software for iCloud first and then you'll be able to take care of this step, okay? For those of you that have already done it, we'll continue. Go ahead and click on iCloud. And then the iCloud control panel will come up. And so what you want to do is you want to check the button that says photo stream right here. Okay, and then you're going to click apply. And then we are going to actually click on options. And so we click on options, it actually shows you the folders that um, photo stream is going to set up with. And so uh, once this is set up, any pictures you have in your photo stream will automatically be downloaded to your PC. Okay, so um, just the first folder here, um, it's going to be in pictures, and I'll show you exactly where to find it. But uh, basically, it's in pictures, and there's going to be a folder that says a folder that says photo stream, and then it'll say my photo stream as well. So go ahead and click on OK, and then we're going to hit close. Now, to find those files, you're going to go ahead and go to Start, and then come to Pictures, and then from here, you're going to come down to where it says Photo Stream. Double click on that, and then here are our two folders. We have our Photo Stream, My Photo Stream folder, and we have our Uploads. So if you double click on My Photo Stream, here's a couple of pictures, and it's actually downloading a whole bunch. It's downloading all the photos right now that are in My Photo Stream. So this is so cool because now it's it's easier than ever to get the pictures off of your iPad, iPhone, iPod Touch right onto your computer because PhotoStream with uh, in conjunction with iCloud, it automatically downloads it to the computer for you. Okay? And so this will keep going until it takes all those pictures that were on my iPad and on my iPhone that were, are in the photo stream. It'll take them and download them to the computer. And every time you take a picture, it's going to automatically sync it. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Now, if we, this little arrow here is the back arrow. Let's go back one page. You have another fo folder that says Uploads. Now, here's the thing. The way the way I read this and the way it's supposed to work is you're supposed to be able to just take a picture and drag it into uh, Uploads, and it's supposed to upload to your photo stream. I'm going to take a picture right now. Blog photos. I'm just going to just take a random picture here just so we can um, try this out here. So I'm going to take this picture and I'm going to move it into uploads. In fact, I want to copy and paste because I still want a copy of that. Copy and then double click on uploads and paste. And there's the picture. Now here's the thing. I tried this uh, a little while ago and um, it seemed like it, it kind of takes a little while for that picture to actually show up in your photo stream so just know that the the uploads are not as instant as the downloads are okay but um nonetheless it's all good um if we go back here just so you know what both folders are for and we'll check on my photo stream and now we can see that a lot more pictures have been uploaded okay and i think that's actually the last picture and i'm actually going to do um I'm going to do a picture right now, and maybe we can do a test to see how, how fast uh, it'll upload. So I'm going to take a picture of this screen exactly, okay? So I just snapped the picture here, and uh, we can kind of time it and kind of see how fast. Now, it's still uploading other pictures, so maybe it might take a little bit longer. But um, from what I've seen, I mean, the upload is pretty quick. And hey, you know, I'm... I like to be real about this, so if that photo never shows up, I mean, this will know that it takes maybe like a half an hour or an hour for that photo to actually sync with your photo stream. But nonetheless, this is pretty cool. So on your PC, you know, you'll still be able to access those same files uh, from your photo stream. 
and uh, this is just one of the benefits of having your iCloud set up is now whenever you take a picture and you have iCloud set up um, it will save it to your photo stream as long as you have that option selected in the menu so um, just a cool plus and just makes it uh, easier to make sure that hey you, if somebody gets a hold of your phone or you have any problems at least you'll know that all your important pictures are backed up okay so it looks like it's taking a little while that photo stream picture hasn't shown up yet in here and uh, that's cool just uh, so we know it does take a few minutes for the the upload to get from the from you taking the picture uh, right into your photo stream so um, I was kind of I thought that'd been real cool if I could have taken the picture and it would have like instantly been the photo stream but nonetheless um, it will be downloaded eventually maybe after 20 minutes or 30 minutes or an hour or something like that but um, all your stuff is being backed up in the cloud and you have that extra safety and security of not having to worry about um, you know losing your uh, pictures so that's it for this video this is how you set up your photo stream on your PC using the iCloud uh, control panel. Uh, leave me a comment, let me know what you thought of the video, and subscribe to H2Tech Videos, and have a good one.